Yo, what's up guys? It is Riley and I hope everybody is having an awesome day. Today I got the gold stoner 63 LMG video for you guys today on my road to dark matter and this gun is an absolute monster. I'm not gonna lie when I hopped into these LMGs I didn't think that they would be that good but I've used the RPD quite a bit and obviously I have the stoner gold and they're absolutely beasts. Like the LMGs in this game are crazy. You can beam people from across the map with them. It's just honestly not what i expected at all and i ended up hitting a ton of clips as you guys just saw in the beginning and i actually got my very first nuke on cold war earlier today man using the stoner 63 i did not think my first nuke would be with an lmg on this game but it happened i ended up dropping 34 kills in a row so it was a little bit more than a nuke but i'm just so happy i got the monkey off my back trying to get a nuke been trying to get one forever since the game came out I choked seven brutals if you guys don't know a brutal is 25 kills without dying obviously the nuke is 30 I had seven brutal medals with no nuke I didn't think I could get one but today I broke the curse I got my first nuke so I'm super excited to show you guys that gameplay obviously that's going to be the gameplay in this video because it's my first nuke so just like I was saying guys this gun is absolutely crazy I mean I'm going to show you my favorite class setup later on in the video before I drop the gameplay I'm going to show you what attachments I run with my play style and what I feel like is the best if you are using the stoner 63 it's a monster guys you should definitely try this gun out so yeah with that being said let's hop right into the class setup before we hop into the class setup I want to ask you guys what is your favorite thing about season one personally I really like that they brought back raid I mean that's a staple classic bo2 map i'm super happy they brought that back i'm excited to start grinding normal maps once i'm done dark matter obviously i'm just running nuketown because it's the best for leveling up guns and attachments and stuff but i can't wait to grind some regular maps get back to sniping it's going to be so much fun but yeah let me know what is your favorite thing about season one so far all right so here we are with the class setup for the stoner 63 this is what i believe is the best class setup in cold war with this gun it's what I was running while I was leveling up the gun entirely, and it's just what I would recommend for you guys if you want to use this gun. So to start us off, I just rock the iron sights. I actually like the iron sights on this gun. The last couple guns I've used, I've been throwing red dots on them all, but I actually like the iron sight stoner a lot, which is nice because then it frees up a slot for a different attachment. I like to rock the 21.8 inch task force barrel this is the same as my last video it just gives you everything damage gives you a damage boost damage range bullet velocity it, you unlock it last in the barrel category but it is definitely one of the best attachments this attachment allows you to beam people across the map and it's just really nice overall before I unlocked the 21.8 inch task force, I was using the 18.6 inch division. It gives you damage and shooting move speed, which is nice, but until you unlock the 21.8, I would rock this. So for the body, this is kind of a new attachment I've been messing around with. I used it when I was sniping a lot because it's really nice for spotting players on the map. Like sometimes I can't see enemies very well, but this attachment completely removes that problem. It gives enemies a little circle, a red circle above their head, so it's super easy to track enemies. And I've been throwing it on red guns, and it's actually really nice. I would recommend throwing this on and trying it out for yourselves. For the underbarrel, I rock the Field Agent foregrip. Nothing much to this one, just vertical and horizontal recoil control. Keep your gun sturdy. For the mag, I was rocking the standard fast mag. This just gives you reload quickness. Obviously, with the LMGs, the reload time is super slow, so I just threw this on fast mag there's no cons just allows you to reload quicker with the lmg i feel like there's no need for more bullets like you have 70 rounds in a mag it's more than enough so i just rocked the fast mag and for the handle we got the airborne elastic wrap you know one of my favorite attachments in the game i say it every video but just allows you to drop shot gives you ads time actually the ads time is huge because the lmgs do aim in pretty slow so when you get that 30 percent ads time it helps out a ton and that's going to be it for my stoner 63 class setup guys i'm going to leave you with the gameplay like i said earlier it's my first nuclear on cold war super excited to share this one with you guys you get to see my live reaction of getting the nuclear I, like i said i just feel like the curse is broken and i can drop a bunch more nukes now if that makes sense but yeah 34 kill streak enjoy the gameplay i think i dropped like 95 kills in total i, I don't think i broke 100 but i did get the nuke drop 95 so it's a banger. Leave a like if you guys enjoyed this video at any point in time. And if you are new, please consider subscribing. We we're grinding so hard with this dark matter. We still got all the secondaries and stuff to do. So lots of content on the way. 
So yeah, guys, that's going to be it from me. I'm taking off now. Enjoy the gameplay, and I'll see you in my next video. It is going to be the gold RPD, and that'll probably be up pretty soon because I'm getting around to editing this later on today. So I've been grinding with the RPD. I already got it level 50. So that RPD video will be coming soon, guys. And take care. I'll see you in the next one. Twenty one. Thirty. Nuke. Let's go. Oh my god, finally, dude. After choking seven brutals, we finally got a nuke, man. Oh my god, we're still going. Let's see how far we can take this. 
Oh my god, dude. Leave a like. Let's go. First nuke. Oh my god. It took me so long. Holy. I'm actually so stoked I just got a nuke. Like, oh my god. Holy, what the? Oh my god, I can't believe I got a nuke. I'm literally, I feel like the curse is over, man. After choking so many. I was low key nervous there. Let's go, baby. 95 and 17 with a nuke. My first nuke on Cold War, dude. Unreal. Took me so long to get one. Like I said, I choked seven. I had seven brutal medals and no nuke. Unreal. Oh my god. Let's go, guys. Leave a like for my first nuke. Let's go.